Good morning, you guys. It's a couple hours later. Actually, I'm running late. Um, I'm actually running late to my facial. My facial, my facial. How did I just go from like super sleepy to getting excited about my facial? But I have a chemical pill today, y'all. So I have a chemical pill and we're gonna go wash my face. Yes, yes, yes. She did accidentally fall asleep in her makeup. But I was tired, and although we didn't get in the house later, um, I was, yeah, I was pooped out, and I don't, I think it was just those dreams, but, oh, girl, mm -mm. but you guys, so let's wash my face. <laughs> All done. She's giving fresh face. She's giving fresh face to Bay. Okay, so now that's that. Let me see what time it is because I know that I am running late. I hope. Oh, it's 1.30. Okay, I hope I got all of this makeup. Oh my gosh, I look horrible. Mm. I need some lip gloss. Y'all, ooh. Hopefully, I really, really hope this chemical pill is like um, super sensitive or works sens for sensitive skin because I have sensitive skin. Like my skin keloids. So I hopefully, I'm going to allow her to know that. Well, not allow her, my smart ass. I'm going to let the esthetician know that. But that's the only thing that I'm really, really like um, kind of nervous about like the harsh how harsh it's gonna be but outside of that you guys i'm super excited i got her on like for a reasonable price anyway so i got the lady for a real reasonable price so hopefully and she has really good reviews so hopefully that a company with her educating me on the chemical pills I select the right one for myself but I just want to have like glowy skin and I want to get rid of like all the dead skin I have oh but y'all too also uh I never even wanted a chemical pill for real like I seen Keisha Kaylee get herself a chemical pill and really enjoy um she enjoyed the after effect or the um what's the word that i'm looking for y'all i just thought or doing my research for a hydrofacial i was told that or i found out like with your hydrofacial they expect you to do a chemical pill first so the hydrofacial is just to boost like whatever chemical pill you had previously so other than that i will be getting the hydrofacial but yeah i'm super excited i'm super excited for her to educate me on what the crap i'm getting Oh shit, I still got makeup in my damn eyebrows. Hopefully they got dang on machines to do that. I just don't feel like it and I'm not messing with it. So it's on you girl. Okay, y'all I'm so confused because on the directions it says it's in the second floor inside of Wink. That is Wink up there. How do I? get inside y'all I have no idea how to freaking get inside of wink so let's just go let's go inside of the alterations place and let's see if they know how there has to be some stars over here Hi, are you coming? Yes. There has to be some stairs, y'all. There's no way. And my camera's going dead. No. No. Like, hell no. Oh, okay. There we go. I was getting ready to say. Okay, second floor inside of a wing. 
Yeah, I'm excited for my thing. She'll, yeah, I'm just like 10 minutes late. <laughs> I'm always so late. 10 minutes, but that's okay because I'm literally like right around the corner. So, I need to change batteries. Because since I'm late, I know she want to get straight to the point, so. Okay. She said, Wink. Y'all, let me change my battery. There go Wink. We found Wink. Hello. Uh, I have an appointment with Candace. Okay, thank you. So, y'all, I'm so sorry. Like, I could have recorded so much stuff, but my battery ended up going dead, and I didn't even bring my extra battery. Like, I thought, where do I look in this phone? Okay, I guess I'll look there. I'm not sure. But, y'all, look at my face. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm excited to see it peel. Uh, come on, go elevator. I'm excited to see it peel. She told me that I didn't have really, um, I didn't have bad skin. So, the chemical peel that I chose... Y'all, sorry if my eyes are wherever they're not supposed to be because I don't. I'm using my phone and I don't got no clue. But um, she told me my I didn't qualify for a certain chemical pill because um, my skin is a little bit sensitive. But y'all, why the fuck? Why did nobody tell me shit burned? Ooh, tropical smoothie. Don't want tropical smoothie. Um. We just gonna ride the elevator real quick. But yeah, so why did nobody tell me this freaking thing burns? Like it burns so bad. Y'all can still kind of see the redness like in my T-zone. Like, yeah. Mm, it doesn't feel tight or anything. But um, yeah, I'm excited. Like skincare, like it's so freaking much to skincare. Okay, y'all, I'm back at home. Um, just gotta put some of these groceries away. Ooh. Y'all, it's so much stuff. But, um, I'm so freaking clumsy. Oh, she's living on me. Oh, I just be buying stuff, y'all. I don't even be knowing. This little boy trips me out. Like, this is the stuff that he does. Like, instead of just taking this, throwing it in a trash can, he'll leave it up there. Like, ooh. I don't know if that's a boy thing or if that's like, let me turn that light on because I don't think y'all can. Ooh. My face is starting to feel tighter. Let me see. I could definitely feel it getting tighter. And it itches too, so I'm trying, like I keep catching myself like. You guys know chicken pox. It don't, it don't, it don't itch you that bad, but I just, you know how your parents or grandparents used to put um, socks on your hands to prevent you from scratching? That's what I'm gonna have to do to myself in a second because I keep scratching at my skin and I, I gotta stop. <laughs> oh, my baby! Hi, son. How was school? Oh, okay, you look handsome. Guess what we got? You get on my nerves! How do you always guess everything right? I got you set. So today is Tuesday. No, today is Friday. Jesus. Today is Friday. And today marks like day two of my chemical pill, I think. Yeah, today's day two. And y'all, I'm like starting to get really, really concerned. Um, One, it is super tight on my face. But like some spots are still wet from like the actual facial. So I don't know if that's what was supposed to happen or not. And then also... I don't know if you guys can like see hold on let me try to get there we go i don't know if you guys can see like there's welting 
in my face like I uh, got poison ivy or like you know how you get a whooping with a belt <laughs> okay let me not tell my childhood but if you guys can see really close y'all see that like it looks like welts and I don't know I'm not peeling it all I don't know I don't know if I was supposed to start peeling already oh you know what she told me no she said I won't be I won't start peeling to Saturday but I don't know y'all I'm starting to think that I just I won't peel I don't know something about my whole process and about my face still kind of like being wet and like like I don't keep your hand out your face I don't know why I don't why I think that I won't peel chemical peel day three I'm feeling so good. Day three. The only issue that I have is that it's very itchy. But outside of that, like it's it's fine. I just want to take my nails and just. <sighs> good morning, you guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today is Wednesday, but the only day I'm supposed to be vlogging because that's my off day. Y'all should know that if you've been watching me. But today's Wednesday, and I'm getting ready to head to uh, where I'm going. Oh, I'm headed to the hair salon. Um, today I'm scheduled to get my um my sewing. I'm getting my sewing removed, and then I'm also getting the silk press, which I'm um pretty excited about the silk press, only because well, I bitch. Let me reiterate. I don't know what to expect when it's coming when it comes to the silk press. Like first of all um it's i'm like so overdue to get my freaking hair cut it's literally been over like a freaking year since i got anything cut with my hair or any my end slipped or cut or anything like that it's just been sewing after sewing after sewing after heat so i'm kind of anxious to see where my hair where my hair falls i know um the last time i checked it was probably like i'll show you guys it was probably uh oh it was probably like where my finger is if you guys can see that which isn't that long at all but the last sewing that you guys seen uh, prior to this one I let one of my em <laughs> um, employees cut or not my employees well I guess I let one of my employees cut my hair take down my sewing in my office to avoid being called ghetto at work and um, I mean, I can respect the fact that she kept it real. She was like, Keisha, I ain't even gonna lie. I cut your hair, and I see, I felt it. You can kind of feel what's like a yank on your hair, which I was like, girl, it's fine. You know, hair grows back. Oh, uh, it's oh, she came. So that is that. Um, I'm on officially on day. What day? What day am I on? I'm on day six of my chemical peel. Um, I did just wash my face, so I'm going to be looking a little bit crusty and busted. Well, I kind of always do when I pick up this camera. But um, my face is probably almost all the way peeled, except for I got up under my chin. Shoot, y'all ain't going to be able to see that because the reflection. But I got under my chin, left. Let me see. And then I have like a patch on this side that's left and then I don't, I don't I don't know I really don't know if y'all can see I think like around my forehead kind of around my nose but yeah each time I wash my face y'all I break out and it burns my skin really badly and then I get these bumps I know I showed y'all the last time but oh I don't know and then I was not when it came to my chemical pill I wasn't expecting for my skin to be almost freaking two shades lighter like I look like a freaking ghost and then my hands is probably like how many shades darker two so uh, um, that is that I've already scheduled my hydro facial my hydro facial I scheduled my hydro facial two weeks from today and I don't think I'm not even I don't think I'm not going to oh, what time is it should I gotta go y'all and this is why I be late cuz I just be talking I just be talking but um 
let's go y'all i'm not going to um i didn't book the the girl who did my chemical pill let me put this milk up i didn't book the girl who did my um chemical pill she was very informative but i just don't like the way she run um kind of run her business when i left she gave me a lot of um she was very informative don't get me wrong but she piled a lot of information on me and gave me a lot of samples so i wasn't able i didn't retain all the information that she gave me so one i did not know where my purse uh, i'll take this back i didn't know that uh i was supposed to wash my face every single day not and i didn't know that until hold on y'all let me put on my shoes I didn't know that I was supposed to wash my um my freaking uh my face every single day until like the third day. Y'all that's K H no kick of K O of the day. K O T <laughs> But so I didn't know that I was supposed to wash my face every two days until like the third day. And then where are my keys? And I need to turn this TV off um yeah and then so when i asked her about it sorry kiki we'll catch you on the way back so when i asked her about it i was like hey am i supposed to be washing my face every single day the only thing she said was she was she was like um she sent me back dang i need to turn off my light too she sent me back a text just saying yes not oh keisha if you haven't been washing your face let me see it what happened anything like that and then I was going to, um, I was, hold on y'all. Why are they not picking up trash? It's freaking cold. Jesus. But, uh, I was going to inbox her or text her suggesting that she have, like, pamphlets to tell her customers what to do each day because I had no clue. Yeah, I still don't know what I'm doing. Like, I have no freaking clue. And I'm not texting her anymore because I feel like that was your job to, you know, reach out to me to let me know what I was supposed to be doing each and every day. What, um moisturizer i'm okay to use what i can't use how am i supposed to sleep all the how many times i'm supposed to wash my face per day and see i only knew that i was supposed to wash my face daily first before i even inboxed her is because i was watching um chemical pill videos on youtube and had i not did that i wouldn't have known so and there's no telling how my face would have would have reacted to me not washing my face at all I could have probably been burnt. Um, so yeah, I think a pamphlet. Who is this? I think. Oh shit. Y'all, it is freaking cold. Oh. I didn't move into um the south, more south. I was not expecting it to be this cold in um freaking Charlotte. It was almost to the fact where I was asking people, I was like, hey, do you guys have UGG season in Charlotte? But back to what I was talking about. So, anyways, I feel like she could have used, like, a pamphlet or provided her customers with a pamphlet. But, you know, that's too much, like, right? And then some people are sensitive about their business and can't take constructive criticism. So, I just left it alone. And I haven't said anything to her. The only thing that she was um, really concerned for and concerned about was me sending her pictures every single day. Bitch, I sent her that one picture. No, I'm lying. I sent her two pictures. And that was it. I was like, I'm not sending her anything else. One, I didn't sign up to be sending you pictures every day. Two, why am I sending you pictures every single day? Like, I send you pictures and then her reply, she, she doesn't give any feedback or say, okay, perfect. This is what it's supposed to be doing on day two. Boom. Or Keisha, make sure that you're putting the, you know, the moisturizing cream. Or, I don't know. <laughs> Close. It's fine. Okay. okay. Bitch, stiff work. Stiff work. <laughs> yeah, why do I always set myself up? Hello, Barbara. This is Shirley. 
Y'all, it's so bouncy, but I look like someone's grandmother. Like, I really look like somebody's grandma. But I was getting ready to go to, um, I was getting ready to go take myself out to dinner, but mm -mm. no, ma'am, we not. Man, where are you going with this? Ma'am, no. And it's not ugly. It's just I feel... I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to put this in a, a freaking ponytail, like, right now. Not right now, but right now. I'm back from the grocery store, and this is pretty much everything I got here. Um, I know they're still in the bag, but y'all, I just got some chicken wings, and I'm about to have my... uh going to eat this fruit. And my chicken at the same time but this is just a review of everything um that i just got this was not a real grocery shop run i just went to the grocery store to grab a couple of things um for me to cook dinner tonight and then also um just for my so that my son could have something to snack on y'all i haven't seen these cookies in so long but we used to make these in oklahoma or not in Oklahoma, I'm sorry, in St. Louis. Me and my sister, my big sister used to eat uh, the Pecan Turtle Delight. And mm, like I cannot believe that I found these. So I think today, this afternoon, uh, my son and I, we're going to go ahead and bake cookies tonight and probably end up watching um, a movie. But yeah, so I'm going to get ready to start cooking my chicken fettuccine. Oh, let me see, because I didn't think that I had fettuccine sauce and noodles, and I do. So I didn't even have to buy, I didn't have to buy noodles. But, okay, cool. That's fine. Y'all, and then before I cook, I'm getting ready to eat real quick. Um, in addition to my groceries, I end up getting some chicken wings. And it was $2 for this. I think they just, um, they do weigh it. I was going to say, I think they weigh it. But they definitely weigh it. And then I'm going to um, have some fruit. I got some cantaloupe and some watermelon. So I'm gonna have this first. No baby, my mama, my mama's baby, I'm the lucky two. 